We got this shit. On lockdown, baby. On zombie apocalypse. <laughs> Okay, now we are coming from the 3-4 even. I like to stay in this 3-4 formation. I'm going over a bunch of different 3-4 formations for you guys. It seems to be the most popular formation all of this year, and I'm finding some heat. Now, we are going over the cover 3 sky. Now, it's 3-4 even, cover 3 sky. And yes, I'm going to play this in an online ranked game, and I'm going to play this defense every single defensive down so yes I'm going to lose I blitz every single down to try to see the different adjustments I could make with this play against every other situation so I take the loss on these games so you guys don't have to I know a couple people were saying oh the defense can't be that good you're giving up 50 points or you're always losing yes I'm running the same blitz every single down against no matter what my offense my my opponent is doing I'm running this blitz I expect to lose I expect to lose expect to lose expect to lose lose, lose. not in this game I don't later later and if I could know the different adjustments to make on screen passes or Whatever. Oh, we'll see you later, buddy. Uh-oh, somebody knows how to play defense. Different route combinations. And I could relay that message on to you because that blitz got abused by it a couple different times. Then you'll be better off. Let's get back into the setups. Don't flip the play. You just pick it like it, like it is. Now, the good thing about this play is you could run it from both sides of the line. You could run this play from both sides of the line uh, without having to flip the play or doing anything like that. But let's get into this. Let me just show you the setups. It's like a four setup play, but it's so easy to do. Now, of course, we got running back block. Now, how we set this up here is you're going to shift. Now, base a line if they're coming out in like five wide. Uh, I don't know if I would run this against five wide, but what you, you could, I guess. It's if you have the good, if you have good users and you can control your, the guy your user in, you know, it all depends on you. But if your linebackers are spread out wide, your baseline, here they're not. So you want to shift all linebackers to the right. Then you're going to hot blitz your right outside linebacker. Then you're going to slant your D-line to the right, okay? Now, right now it's a five-man blitz, but you could keep it a five-man blitz, but... You want to take this blitzing left outside linebacker and do whatever you want with him. And you could do this with your quick adjustments by pressing R1 twice, square, and then whatever, QB spy. The only thing about this play right here is once you do all this, the weak part of the field, or actually the weakness of this defense, is if they run to this part of the field. So if you want to combat that by just, you know, placing him here, still on his QB spy or, or flat zone, I mean, I guess you could keep him blitzing. But that's up to you but that's just the weakness is them running on this to the opposite side of the blitz so you can try and stop those runs to the left by bring him down and blitz him and that'll help but again you're sending five so you gotta know when to do that know when to send five know when to send four but this is a very good blitz with very good coverage behind it but here we go. And if you want, you could put the right middle linebacker, which is X. You hit R1 twice, X. And then you could put him on a purple zone if you want just to have two purple zones on the field. Or, I don't know, if you want to man him up or put him on a 
flat zone. You can do what you want, but it's a mainly just a four-man blitz. You can hover here, hold R1, uh, R2, or L2 through the snap, then go out to coverage. Go left and then out to coverage. Now, just know that when you set this up, if you don't put the if you put this guy in a purple zone the middle of the field is going to be open so that's your job to cover like the tight end here he'll look open this is why you can do something like that you can kind of bait your opponent into throwing to him it's only if you take that linebacker off his yellow zone and put him in a purple because now i didn't do that and he kind of covers that area right so good so that's what i'm saying it's it's if you take that this guy if you take him off his yellow zone and put him in a purple zone just know that the middle of the field will be open don't do part of that oh you did it i told you don't do it what you're seeing a gameplay i think we have one play where uh we run the splits to the left now. You don't have to flip the play to run it to the opposite side of the field. Shift all linebackers to the left. Slant your D-line to the left. Hot blitz the middle linebacker, which is triangle because square is already blitzing. And then you could keep this a five-man blitz if you want. That'll come in. Look how fast that is. Or you could take that right screen D-end off of his blitz. So I'm keeping in a five-man blitz and watch how fast that left the screen, that left outside the linebacker gets in. He comes screaming through straight line to the quarterback. Here it is. This is live game. Watch what happens when we run this blitz to the left. Screaming in, baby. It's a trap. Oh, you're screwed, bud. Hasta la vista. Baby. Give me that, give me that, give me that, give me that, give me that. Okay, we got one last part to this. Now, this is more of a lines of kind of playing mind games with your opponent, especially if he likes to run on this defense, because it is running on this defense is its weakness. So, there's really no difference in setup, what we're about to show you, but we're just playing little mind games with your opponent. And this is how you want to do this. If you're running the blitz and you sack him a couple times, but then he's running to the left, you know, you set it up. You set it up normally, but he's still getting his yards and this way running and everything. And, you know, you just want to try to combat what he's doing. What you want to do is just add two more steps. Just base a line show blitz then set it up set the blitz up now you gotta be a little bit quicker because what you're gonna do from here now the blitz is set up but you, what you want to do from here is not change anything that you move him here and move this safety down here now this looks like an all-out run defense which it's not you're still only sending four so this will confuse the shit out of your opponent because he might switch to a pass and look Blitz is still coming, and everybody's covered. So this is just a little tip of like playing a little mind games with your opponent. And you could do this quick. You could even just <clears throat> show blitz, because that brings that safety down a little bit. So as he's coming down, just do the blitz's setup. Move him down, and then move him down if you have time. Because now it looks like you're all out committing to stopping the run. They might audible into like a pass play. And bam, you're going to be right there to pick it off. So this is just a little another way to try to confuse your opponent. Because this is what it's all about, playing defense. Playing defense is confusing your opponent. If you do that right and you're successful at it, you're going to get the results that you're looking for. If you're quick enough with the setting up, the plays you'll be able to get this off but anyway if you're new to the channel smack a like on the on this video the little thumbs up go hit that subscribe to us and hit that little notification bell because we are spitting out videos fast for you guys so i'm trying to get the losses out 
so you can get the wins. Is this this guy's first time playing this game? So I'm talking about Ladder Run baby run baby run Please don't quit Don't quit Please just don't quit Yeah boy Oh, uh, what side am I coming from? What side am I coming from? Oh, that's going to help you. That's definitely going to help. Later. I'll see you later, boy. Quit, quit, quit. It's not your fault. I just got that good D, that's all. Do not blame yourself. Like the video, subscribe. I'm JP Storm. Thank you guys for watching. Yeah!